Augmented reality with mobile devices is uh, just bringing marketing and bringing um, real-time experiences to a whole new level. Oh, an innovative product that I love is Rogers being able to buy your concert tickets via your cell phone and avoid Ticketmaster service charges. I think the electric car seems to have great promise. Recently, I purchased a bottle of champagne. What was great for me is that the seal was reusable. What truly sets our list of 20 innovators apart is not simply having one brilliant idea. It is having multiple ideas. A company must be able to take that raw idea, put it to work, make it pay off, monetize it, in other words, being truly innovative means having the ability to combine the ingenious concept with the courage and know-how to act on it and find success in the marketplace. This is so unexpected and such an honor. We're really happy and proud to be a BC-based company. Well, my first thoughts when uh, Ben approached me about the technology were the, the elegance of the technology and also the tremendous scope and opportunity. This little machine you see here is the same machine that NASA procured. And behind me is an invention that's barely even 12 months old. This is where the salt comes out. In essence, fresh water comes out one end and solid salt comes out the other end. That's very important in industry. For example, the tar sands, uh, where ponding is becoming a concern, or injecting waste salt water underground is becoming a concern. These companies need to recycle their water. Preferably, they would like a machine that gives them fresh water back that they can reuse and condenses all of the waste products to solids, which are much easier and lower cost and less environmental impact to handle. At Blends, our philosophy around social media is that it's a form of reality entertainment. And all of our customers come to Blends every day to have really frank, open conversations with each other. And we believe that social media is simply and purely an extension of the coffee shop conversation. During the Olympics, we were able to become a really active and um, important part of the community when we developed a, a group of about 40 bloggers. And they were individually interviewed and chosen to go out to different venues and participate in the Olympics live. That information was fed back to Blends all day, all night for the entire um, period. And it, it's just a further example of um, social media live and well and Blends being active in the social community. When we first started Idea Rebel back in 2008, the first and foremost from an operational perspective, we were able to start the business with, with a green mindset. We've never used a printer, we've never had a printer in the office. We've been able to use digital devices such as iPads, uh, digital screens and a lot of whiteboards uh, to do what, what we do. Um, we can't stop mail from coming in, right, and we can't stop some people from using uh, notepads every once in a while, but other than that we truly are paperless. Try to use as uh, uh, minimal lights as possible, so you can see the large windows that we have that actually provide tons of natural light for the team. Anybody that wants to uh, go out and do an errand around the city, uh, that's the bike to do it. Steve Jobs has been a huge, I guess, I never knew him in person, but a mentor to me uh, when it comes to um, innovation, just in general. He always seemed to push the limit. Other innovators, um, to be honest, uh, Richard Branson, I see him as an innovator, uh, of excitement. I'm not just interested in the digital world, I also do a lot of stuff with action sports, uh, stuff with music, um, and then obviously digital kind of rounds it out, but uh, I like to consider myself, I guess, rebellious in kind of all of those areas. So.